Hi guys, Rosa with the Cackling Moon. This is going to be your weekly energy reading for the week of today, which is the 14th through the 21st. Um, <laughs> I'm a little late to the game, but I'm here. So we're gonna do this um, how the way I always do it. We're gonna start with our earth signs. We're gonna do earth, air, fire, water. So please look up your sun, moon, and or rising sign and see which element it is. And then you guys can correspond that to the cards that I'm pulling. So my earthy signs, let's see what your week looks like. We got water, <laughs> water, and we also have the page of pentacles. So um, my earthy signs, page of pentacles is a bringer of, of fortune, <laughs> a bringer of fortune. So this is payday week. This is for some of my earthy signs. Payday week. This is receiving, um, receiving a material, something of material value. This could be, um, you know, buying something, going shopping this week. This could be something new that you're going to be bringing into your home. Um, decorating. This could be any kind of element. The pentacle suit is money, but it's also like the material stuff. Um, and then we also have the water energy, which water energy is your emotions. Um, so I feel like it's kind of like a mix. It's like a mix. These, these are kind of like a mix of energies coming up for you guys. Um, the emotions, the water state to me, I'm hearing hydrate for some of my earthy signs. Make sure that you're drinking enough water. Um, for some of you guys, I feel like this is emotions. So there's a lot of flow of emotion coming through for you guys. You might be feeling a little bit more sensitive than, than usual, especially with that full moon that we just had. Um, this could be an overflow of abundance coming your way um, with the page of pentacles which is usually a messenger of money or fortune or finances or beautiful little like knickknacks and stuff so you might be seeing an abundance of that some of you guys might be having your mailboxes full blown with packages of things you ordered that you forgot about and then they're all being delivered all at once <laughs> I mean, it could be just little things like that. Um, I feel like overall with my earth signs, this is a really good week. It's a week of receiving, okay? A week of receiving and it's a week of flow. So I feel like that water is like a, a wave of things coming your way. Um, but if you are on the emotional aspect of this, especially from that full moon that can, that can mess with our emotions, um, make sure that you're taking time for you and that you're taking a break. And so, so take out some money from your checking account, treat yourself a little bit, you know, um, be nice to yourself this week, earth signs. So really good energy for you guys. My air signs, we have <laughs> we have the heart chakra. We also have the star. Ooh, so heart and the star. A lot of healing for some of my air signs. This is healing from certain things that maybe took place recently, healing from a relationship perhaps, healing from some sort of drama that may have erupted within the last couple weeks, okay? Star card energy to me is a card of healing, but it's also renewing hope. Um, it's also renewing hope in your heart sense. So this is like having um, hope in your, in, your, in, in your heart is like your... Um, <laughs> I'm talking too fast. You are reestablishing a love for something, a love for someone, a love for something or an activity in your life. Um, I feel like it's a renewed vow for some people. This could be giving a relationship a second chance. Some of you guys, this could be, um, you know, just, just having some faith in something that maybe that you once lost. Um, the heart chakra is the way you love. It's the way you express your love, but it's also the way you receive love too. So I feel like you guys with the star energy, you guys are being both um, bringers of love, but also receiving it. So it's kind of like a two, like an energy exchange there. So my um, air signs be willing to give and receive, um, give love to people this week, you know, give them smiles and whatnot, but also be willing to receive love too. If someone wants to give you a hug, Hug, let them hug you if somebody wants to give you some advice take it you know you don't have to take it take it but like you know what I mean just be be receivers of things too that's a nice even exchange there for my air signs um fire signs you guys have sorrow <laughs> and you also have the ten of cups interesting so a lot of these like cards are kind of like butting heads um, so the sorrow and then the 10 of cups. So this could be like a family kind of a thing. Some of my fire signs might be reconnecting with some family. I usually see 10 of cups as kind of like a reunion of some sort, um, some sort of big celebration. Um, but some of my fire signs are just not feeling that connectedness. Maybe you're not feeling part of the community and you're feeling kind of like left out. Um, and so maybe that's where that sorrow card is coming from. Um, some of you guys might also be wanting to cancel plans this coming weekend 
because you're just not feeling like you want to be part of the crowd. You just kind of want to do your own thing. You're just like not having enough energy for all of the stuff that's coming up. Um, but I would say give it a shot because that 10 of cups kind of shows a necessary you know, time to be with community, a time to be with your friends and family or people. Um, and I feel like it's like you may be not looking forward to it this whole week, but if you give it a chance, you're going to end up seeing that it was a really good choice to go and to be a part of that. Really nice. I'm going through this really fast, so I might have to spend some more time with some of the cards. My water signs. You guys have passion. We have passion. We also have the hermit. Oh, <laughs> so the Hermit and Passion coming up, um, my water signs, this is a week of feeling, you know, we're feeling really like tuned in with ourselves. Um, a lot of us are going to be a little bit of a loner this week, I feel. Um, but I feel like this is a time for us to seek inward, inner passions. What are we inner, what are we passionate about on the deeper level? Okay. What's going on deep in our hearts? What's going on in our minds? Like Hermit card is, is asking you to dig deep with the self. So my water signs, this is a lot of inner, um, inner, inner work, inner investigation. Um, we're coming on to Scorpio season in a few more days. And so I feel like that um, is, we're kind of feeling it too with especially us water signs if you are a Scorpio. Scorpio season is transformation. It's just like a lot of the darker stuff. And so I feel like we're feeling that and we're feeling really passionate about it. Like this is our season. This is our time of year. So I feel like this week is really good, but I, I say for water signs to kind of, take it a little bit slow and maybe sit off to the back in the corner. You don't need to be front row center this week, okay? Um, anything else that's coming through with my cards, with my with my signs? Because um, what time? We have six. Oh, I finished this fast. Okay, let's, let's pull another card for my earth signs because that was tripping me up a little bit. So my earthy signs, let's get another card. <laughs> you guys got the devil. Um, so the devil card coming up with the page of pentacles in that, in that water sign. Um, I feel like my earth signs, you're, you're kind of feeling your personality is being split in two perhaps this week. Um, some of you guys are just like emotionally connected. Some of you are emotionally disconnected. Some of you guys are just, you know, wanting to spend your money. Maybe, you, <laughs> maybe that devil card matched with the page of pentacles is kind of saying, you know, better than to spend your money, but you just don't know what to do with yourself because there's a lot of emotion running through you. And you're just like, I just want to spend money and don't want to deal with reality. <laughs> <laughs> that's kind of what I'm seeing from my earth signs. This is going to be a crazy week for you guys. I feel you guys are just going to be all over the place. Um, especially earthy because you're used to being grounded, but this water stuff is totally tripping you guys up. So get your floating devices so you don't sink this week. Um, my air signs with you guys with the star and the, and the heart chakra, my air signs, if you guys have air sign people in your life, these are the people you want to kind of go to this week. Um, <laughs> they have all of the love to give. They're probably going to have a lot of advice to give you. You're probably going to be receiving a lot of good messages from earth si or air signs. So if you guys follow astrologers or tarot readers or whatnot that are earth based i mean earth oh my god that are air based signs um they're gonna have a lot of, of good things to say so i myself am a gemini rising a gemini is earthy i mean air sign energy i'm also on the aquarius um cusp so i am a pisces but i'm like a couple degrees away from being a, an aquarius so <laughs> So my messages might be resonating hard with some of you guys. Um, I also feel really bad. Let's pull another card because we have like one more minute for the fire signs because you guys are going through like, I don't know if I want to play. I don't know if I want to go outside and play with the people. You, <laughs> you guys got the fool too. So my fire, my fire signs... You have, you're having your little pity parties this week. You you may not want to go and, may, and go through with the plans this weekend. You guys are kind of feeling like, I don't know if I want to deal with so-and-so. The full card is saying, just go for it. Just dive for it. So I think this is going to be one of those cases where you guys are going to, you're kind of like seeing the outcome as being doom gloom. But once you're actually in it, you're going to be like, oh my God, I'm so glad I came to this party. Or I'm so glad I came to this, this event or whatever the case, this dinner party. I don't know. There's going to be a lot going on this weekend for my fire signs and maybe that's why you guys are just like I don't have the time and energy and patience for these people but go ahead and do it the full card is saying just dive right in so all right you guys thank you so much for tuning in I hope you enjoyed the weekly readings if you have any questions comments concerns leave them below I wish you a beautiful week and I will talk to you guys later bye loves